Hey everyone and welcome back to yet another episode of 2 minutes Tuesday. Today we are going to see how we can relink our missing path without using any gizmo. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Okay, as you can see over here, I am having my script open and a few things you are getting over here is missing. So what I have to do just I have to select any read node. I will go over here and I will go to select similar and class. So what will happen each and every read node will be selected here. You have to do few things, right? So I'll go over here in edit in node and I'll go to file name and search and replace. So you will get two things search for and replace with search for will be your earlier path where your file was and replace with will be your new file location where you have kept it currently right so what i'll do before pasting anything over here i'll go over here and i'll double click and probably i will select my path so i i don't want any particular folder i want my main folder that's why i copied it from here and also i will go over here again one more time and i will go to search similar uh, class and also I'll go to edit node file name search and replace and I will place my earlier path or older path now you need to paste your current path so here is a trick so basically this is my current path which I have paste my files over there but you need to understand that you need to replace your backward slash with forward slash otherwise it won't work so in my case it's working with my forward slash so what i'm going to do i'm going to copy my new file location and i'm going to paste it over here and as i'm going to hit ok as you can see over here my each and every read node is being replaced with new location right so i think this will help you to understand a uh, relink in a better way already i have made one video where i uh, showed you a way how we can use our gizmo to do that but in this way you don't need any gizmo and your work will be done very quickly just you have to take care about that you have to replace your backward slash with forward slash i hope this video is helping you and if you think that this video is helping you please don't forget to like this video share this video and if you're new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe with this said this is vfx vibe signing off have a good day